The following video is a recap of The Takeover Continues and Pin Pup Community Day. Welcome to Lewis's Adventures Plays Pokemon Go. Me, Lewis Marinucci, as your host. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. In this video, I cover the Team Go Rocket event, the takeover continues, and close this out with Pin Pup Community Day. If you notice some parts of the video where my voice sounds funny. That's because I was sick during the making of this video and I was getting over the flu. In the meantime, enjoy this video, everyone. I've also decided to include the new Team Go Rocket event. The first set of tasks involving me defeating five Team Go Rocket grunts catching a shadow Pokemon and spending 10 Pokestops. Unlike the previous two special research events, this time you only have to spin three Pokestops a day, purify five shadow Pokemon, and do five raids, which of course that's where we're on current. I'm about to do my first Party Hat Wobbuffet raid. Stay tuned to see if I finally get it. I was able to successfully complete the raids for Party Hat, Ratata, and Wobbuffet. This was before I got sick with the flu and things were put on hold. In the meantime, I continue with the takeover continues after I had healed and got over this virus. Like with the first two quests, we have to defeat all three Team Go Rocket leaders, Arlo, Cliff, and Sierra once again before we take on Giovanni, which is the fourth step of this quest, just like the previous one. I was successful in getting my first timber because you need at least a lot of timber candies, 100, and you also have to trade one because recently Pokemon Go adapted the um, trade evolution mechanics from the main series. Finally defeated the three Team Go Rocket leaders. Now the next step is to find and defeat Giovanni. I was able to finally defeat Giovanni. Now the last thing to do to close out this video is Pimp Up Community Day. We're on our way down to the Philadelphia Museum of Art for Pimp Up Community Day. I hope to catch as many shinies as I can. Stay tuned to see if I'm successful. As you see here, I had a blast during community day. I was able to catch nine shiny pimplup. Not to mention, I was also able to do a Heatran raid, but of course it didn't turn out to be shiny. But still, it felt great to be back out there doing what I love. And that is delivering amazing content to you, my viewers, and everyone else around the world after being brought down by the mighty flu bug. In the end, I won the battle, and I'm now back. That's all that matters.
My final shiny count for this Pimp Up Community Day is nine. Nine shinies for the for the first community day of 2020. This is Lewis signing out saying, thanks for watching everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And remember, it's time for adventure.